What's up guys? CJ here for Kung Fu Nights and it is time for some more community. We're on season 4, episode 12. Comparative religion. Now this should be interesting. I'm not going to waste too much time. I'm going to get right into it. Song. Everybody loves Billy Joel. Oh. I couldn't name one song by him. Maybe Thank if I you, heard Shirley, it. I'm gonna but not by name. Put that in the pocket closest to my heart. Or maybe we didn't start the fire. Is that him? We maybe maybe I can't name him. I'll shut up. Everybody. Hey! Hey! You took all the winter doodles. What are you, trouble. Look at this dude in his posse. Friends, but there's a lot of other cookies left. No. What are you, an idiot? Nah, man. Okay. You don't do that. We get it. You and the A team are awesome. Now beat it. Oh, but you beat him up. Pretty boy standing up for bird face over here. Knock, knock. My fist up your balls. <laughs> Who's there? Oh, oh. Say no more. <laughs> the bully of community college. <laughs> Bro, our crew can take that crew. Come on. No fuck with Abed. My bodyguard, but I was the kid from Meatballs. Jeff was the guy from Full Metal Jacket. And the mustache guy was the brother of the guy in Entourage. Thanks for dumbing that down for us. Yeah. So what's the deal, Jack? I heard the Full Metal Jacket one. Men were wired to fight each other so that women could choose the right mate. No, the real reason men fight is to release their pent-up gayness. That guy wasn't gay. He had a mustache. You know what I have? Finals. Are we cramped? <laughs> uh, quick question. Are you all coming to my Christmas party right after the final, or are you stopping home to change into your Christmas outfit? Both. I better go. One might even say I'm Jewish. I respect all religions of the world. I'm Muslim. Jehovah's Witness. Atheist. The Lord is testing me. Guys, I'm agnostic. Oh. 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 Agnostic. <laughs> Lazy man's atheist. <laughs> Level five laser lotus in my Buddhist community. Uh, that does not sound like Buddhism. Are you sure you're not in a cult? Just the white lotus? Fire. Yeah, but we don't celebrate birthdays or Christmas, and we can't drink. But it helps. So you're like a Muslim? You don't celebrate birthdays? So like, a ding dong. Wow. Don't we have a diverse little family? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Evil man. Hey, did you get going, Chuck Norris? Did you just shoot me? I didn't just kiss him. <laughs> Senior Chang, can you do something about this? Yeah. I'll allow. <laughs> okay, boss, I'm here. Huh? Mid test. Even I know that. <laughs> Three o'clock. Bike rack, but not the one by the parking lot. <laughs> the one by the trash cans near the orange cones with the middle of the wheelchair ramp. Yeah. Best. Exam ever. I know guys like this, Mike. He used to be a nerd, now he's a meathead. Dangerous combo. Tyson, Lou Ferrigno, Rosie Tyson? O'Donnell. Tyson? You're a pretty big dude. Are you <laughs> telling me you've never been punched in the face? No. Thank God, this is the moneymaker. First time I got punched in the face, I was like, oh no. But then I was like, this is a story. It's a rite of passage. Before I assume you're handy with a switchblade. Hey, Ben, you get back to the family tent try to find a chicken for Jeff to chase. Guys, I appreciate the enthusiasm. Give me a snowman, dork! You know what I want? I would like a zebra See, cake right now. Huh? A staple? <laughs> Jesus. Boy to the world, the Lord I had a dream about a zebra cake last night. I think that's where that came from. Oh, is this your Hanukkah holder? Pretty. Oh, just, uh, it's just great. Oh, Here. no. That's nice. So, <laughs> Jeff wants to fight that bully. Shit. On Christmas. <laughs> Will you excuse me? But it's not Christmas <laughs> today, technically, <laughs> right? <laughs> then you give him the Forrest Whitaker eye. Yo, Forrest Whitaker <laughs> do be... Okay, hold that <laughs> he do be looking a little crazy out here. Then, you look straight through his eyes, deep into his soul. And then you move to Vermont. What's up with Vermont, Vermont and being gay? Hips, what man. are you, North Korean seamstress? Hips. Not that bad. Get mad! Come on! That's good. You better put your blouse back on. Oh! <laughs> ow! That is not cool! Well, that foxy black girl thinks it is. Hmm? Ow! What are you doing? Why does she have to be black? What is going on? <laughs> you realize 
is no other way for me to take this in as a giant middle finger to the most important day of the year. December 10th. I love Matt Shirley. Our Christmas. And I'm having a party due to my divorce. And, my and now she's like, oh, this will be the I'm the light, Shirley. I'm the, uh, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then we have a serious discussion and find that a brownie helps them to relax. So, why do you hate me and Jesus? It's December 10th. Yeah, isn't that Christmas? Religion is like Paul Rudd. Chill as fuck. I see the appeal, and I would never take it away from anyone, but I would also never stand in line for it. What? And look, Shirley. Paul Rudd is hilarious. I forbid you from fighting. You can't do that, Shirley. Well, you don't get to. You're not my mom. You're right. Come on, Shirley, don't be mad. I'm not mad, I'm disappointed. That's mom for mad. Oh, man. Oh, hat brown and applesauce. That's nice. Oh, That's what nice. is that interesting <laughs> smell? Trash brings an applesauce. That's. Oh look, we gotta rock what she believes in. Nothing. Where should I put my? I wanna go to Jeff's fight. As I told Jeff, no one that goes to the fight can come to my party. He's dead to me, and if any of you leave, you'll be dead to me too. You're so <laughs> scarily sweet. If you really want us to be your second family, then you've got to start treating us like one. Even if can't dictate out here. No backup today. You always like grandpa, posse, bro. You... Are you perpetually on your way to the gym? Dude, my life is a gym. <laughs> well, well, stop, 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 stop. Did you wear a bracelet? <laughs> <laughs> this is the time of year where you put aside your differences and you make peace. Me? What would Shirley do? Oh, really? Not shot. What would Shirley do? I think. What would Shirley do? Smith. All right, let's go. Let's get in there. Come on, guys. His yeah. Are <laughs> oh, these things flipping out here? What the fuck? Oh, come on. Is everyone gonna get their ass kicked? Come on. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. The girl, the girl there the whole time. Hilarious. Dude! <laughs> oh, he needed, a, he needed a hit in the face, that's right. Thank you, I get it, yes, it is I, Senior Chang. Shakira, hold this. So, I have finished grading everyone's finals. All of you are moving on. Yeah! You see me next semester. In Spanish, 102! And I'm the only Spanish teacher? Yeah! Showing up and having my back when we fought those fly dancers. Yeah, so, they just started uh, fucking my <laughs> doing flips and shit. Oh, Christmas joy, oh, Christmas joy, much pleasure thou canst give me. Why do you guys do stuff like this? Because it's fun. Because it's fun. Oh! Let's go! Uh, so anyways, yeah, that was season one, episode 12. I called that last line. I'm very proud of that. I'm taking all the credit for that. I'm patting myself on the back for that. Was it an easy one? Maybe. But I, I'm still I'm still happy with it. I'm happy with that as well as this episode. We had a big brawl with our crew against a bunch of community college flying ninjas. That are deceivingly in shape. Led by Mustache Man. Sure. Very, very fun episode, I would say. I think this is one of the first times that we've had... When we've had our split with, within the plot. You know, like... Jeff versus everybody, or everybody versus Jeff, or something like that. This is the first time where everyone's taking... Take, cake, blah, blah, taking Jeff's side. And, you know, Shirley was the outlier. I guess on that but yeah this is a fun like change of dynamics for these episodes you know rather than you know anyways very very fun change in the dynamics I would say lots of Shirley in this episode and and you know I love me some Shirley I just said it before but just how is it polarizing or how quickly her vibe and tone can shift it is very motherly in a way, 
Um, but how she goes from the serious Shirley to the light and aw, Shirley kind of a thing. And yeah, she's she's just a, she's just fun to watch, honestly. Am I, was I confused or was any is any crushing on on Jeff? Am I just re reading that completely wrong? Um, I know she and Troy have a thing for the younger girl to be like, oh, like he's so cool, you know, kind of a thing. I don't know. I'm getting that kind of a vibe. Um, might be completely off base. Might be right. I don't know. Yeah, we're coming to Abed's defense in this, man. You know, this dude's gonna smack the snickerdoodle cookies or the snacky doodle, whatever the hell they were. You're gonna, you know, throw some shit around. No, and then and then want to eat it. No, we're gonna be fighting for Abed. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Anyways, um, so I'm gonna close this. So I'm gonna close this episode. This reaction out. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell so you know when the next community reactions are coming out. Not sure what the next one's called, but it's available on Patreon, depending how you watch it. As well as at least 12 episodes ahead, I believe. I think that's the that's the spread. Excuse me, from YouTube to Patreon at this point. Um, yeah, links in the description. There might be some stuff you like on there. Yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. I wanna take you for a ride.